In this video, we're going to show you how to load indicators and custom indicators on MT4. When downloading the MT4 platform, there will be a selection of free indicators that come with it. To open these, you can simply open your navigator by clicking this icon here or Control N and you'll see your list of indicators displayed. Just as an example, we may choose to load the stochastic indicator onto our chart. Always remember that indicators are lagging and they are just displaying an interpretation of price action. If I choose to load the stochastic indi indicator onto my chart, I simply drag and drop. Here I have some details that I can choose and some variables that I'm able to change. Certain colors, certain levels, etc. Under visualization, I'm able to choose which particular time frames I'm interested in putting the stochastic on. This type of indicator is particularly useful in the shorter time frames, and I'm going to opt to put it on these three particular time frames M15, M5, and M1. Simply clicking OK allows it to appear. You'll notice it hasn't appeared, and that's because we are on the one hour time frame. And if I were to revert to the 15 minute time frame, my stochastic has appeared. Similarly, if I chose to use the RSI, the relative strength index, the same applies. Drag and drop onto my chart, and I can choose certain inputs, certain colors, levels, and which particular time frames to display it on. You're also able to download certain indicators from the internet and load them on your MT4 platform. To do this, the process is simple. You'd firstly want to save that indicator into your downloads or perhaps your desktop. To load it, go to File, Open Data Folder, and we want to save that particular indicator into our Indicators folder. By double-clicking MQL4 and then Indicators, we have our current list of indicators situated here. I'm simply going to take the pivot points, which is what, what I want to throw onto my charts, which is currently saved on my desktop. And I'm going to drag this folder into our indicators list. And you'll find it's dropped here down here at the bottom. Now that's done, this window can close. What's very important is that I restart MT4 before it's loaded, so simply cross in the corner and reopen my platform. Okay. You'll now see that the pivot points has now been loaded in my indicator list. Again, simply I can drag this onto my chart and choose the particular variables. Once I'm happy with those, simply click OK and you can see the pivot levels have now appeared. The uses and benefits of these indicators will be explained shortly in the FX section. You're able to load as many indicators in your charts as you wish and even to put one indicator on top of another as so. Here I'm throwing the RSI on top of my stochastic and as you can see the two indicators have appeared together. As a general rule of thumb, we like to keep it as simple as possible, and please bear in mind that nothing is more up-to-date than pure price action itself. Lastly, the setup to load custom indicators on a Mac is slightly different, so please bear that in mind.